You're watching WMAR 2 News. I'm Randall Newsom here with your WMAR 2 News update. Tonight, Anne Arundel County leaders will discuss which flags can and cannot fly at county schools. It's the center of a proposed policy coming up at tonight's school board meeting. If it's approved, only the American, Maryland State, Anne Arundel County and Annapolis flags would be allowed to be flown. So far, some of the parents and the teachers association are split on this decision. I support the policy because I feel like the American flag, which is already within the classroom, unites and embodies everybody, no matter who they are, no matter what their beliefs are. We're opposing this because we know that our flags make a difference in our classrooms. Our students come from different countries, they live different lives, and this allows our classrooms to become inclusive environments. Now, the policy does give some ex uh, exceptions, but only for a, quote, bona fide educational purpose. And it's up to the school principal to decide what that means. Tonight's meeting is at 630. All right, let's check on your forecast with meteorologist Cesar Cornejo. Well, Randall, we do have some severe weather threats possible later on this afternoon. That's why we are under, well, most of our viewing area is under this enhanced warning, excuse me, enhanced risk. So it is the level three out of five for damaging winds, large hail and an isolated tornado cannot be ruled out. And even for parts a little bit further to the north and west will also still be under that slight, the level two out of five. So that's something to keep in mind. You'll notice that temperatures do get quite warm and thunderstorms start to return for us towards the afternoon and evening hours. Randall. All right, thank you, Caesar. All right, guys, stay with WMAR2news.com for updates on stories throughout the day and for news and weather while you're on the go. Download the WMAR2news app in your app store. Thanks for watching. I'm Randall Newsom.